What is up guys? It is Afro Ninja back here again in GTA 5 online. I wanted to show you something they've updated after patch 1.14 and that is the effects of drugs and alcohol. As you see here my character has taken a hit from a bong and the lighting effect you notice does kick in but it's ultra bright now and it lasts so much longer. It used to be I would make it about to the door and then the effects would kick out. Now you see I'm in my garage and it's blinding. I look like I'm being abducted. The only real complaint I have, as you'll see here, is the visual effect cuts out as soon as you leave your apartment or your garage. As you see there, it just cut out, but the effect is still there. So I'm going to attempt to drive in a straight line. I have my finger off of the thumbstick. I'm just holding the gas down. And as you see, the effect is still there. I smash into the bus stop. The effects, while the visual one disappears, the physical one doesn't. And so here I'm going to show you the drinking effects. I'll fast forward through all of that and then I'll head out to my garage. The drinking effect as well has been extended. I actually played uh, a good five to ten minutes with the um, effect of it still on. It did not wear off. It used to be maybe 30 to 40 seconds at the most. You would make it out of your apartment and then the effects would be gone. Um, so as you see here, I'll head into the garage, grab my motorcycle again and show you. You can see it's already um, kind of proving that it's lasting longer than it used to. Again, it used to be a really short time that you would have being able to stumble around drunk or stumble around high. Um, so I'll pull out here. And again, one last complaint is the visual effect disappears. It would be so much fun trying to drive around in the day when the lights are blaring. But again, as soon as you get out of your garage or your apartment, the visual effect uh, does disappear. It's no longer there. But again, here I am trying to drive in a uh, straight line. And again, the physical effect is there. So your character will not be able to drive straight. You'll walk funny. You'll slump. Um, other people can see this. We had a party a few weekends ago inside the game and there were people stumbling around. You couldn't really see um, their screen effects. They see their own screen effects, but you definitely see them hunched over and walking around and stumbling about. So I just wanted to show you this is after patch 1.14. So the drunk effects were extended. The high effects were extended. Um, it appears Rockstar did listen. People were talking about this on Reddit, how they would love to see it extended. And so, yeah, it's been fixed. There are a couple things with patch 1.14 that have been changed as well. I'll do some more videos on those later. Um, here I'm going to try to get into a fight. Drunk fights apparently work really well on here. Um, even though you're drunk, it doesn't affect how you're performing when you're boxing. As you'll see, I'll dodge his hits and then take him down pretty swiftly. So... Again, that was the after patch 1.14 notes on drunkenness and being high. I am Afro Ninja. I will be providing more daily GTA content. I'll be throwing in some more Skyrim and some more gaming. So stay tuned here. Make sure to like this video for more, and I will be back later. Peace out, Girl Scouts.